Okay, guys, so this is the mat last on perimeter for this week um, until we probably get to the test. Uh, so we were doing a little bit more of the same. You have to take your ruler. And this one specifically is working with centimeters. So you have to use the centimeter side of your ruler. I feel really dumb taking the one that just has inches on. Um, if you do not have a ruler that has centimeters on it, there are printable ones you can find online. You're going to do the same thing. You're going to practice measuring and put all the sides in and then add up all the sides. Okay, so that's the first part. And the second part is problem solving. So that means we have to use our brain a little bit and probably draw a picture. So let's do this one together. Evan has a square sticker. Squares have all the same sides, right? So we'll draw a square. Um, that measures five inches on each side. What is the perimeter of the sticker? So I drew a square or kind of a square. And now I'm just going to put five on each side because squares all have the same size. What's the perimeter, guys? It's going to be 20. Yeah, 20 what? 20 inches. Okay. Sophia draws a shape that has six sides. Each side is three centimeters long. So for this one, you don't even need to know that it's a hexagon. You can just draw any shape you want with six sides as long as each side is how long? Three centimeters. So I'm actually going to draw a hexagon. Okay, and each side is three centimeters. Now we could add three plus three plus three plus three plus three, or we can do three times six, which we should all know the answer is. 18. And remember, you have to write what kind of unit it is. So this is centimeters, so you can put CM. All right, and for number five, you're going to do that one on their own. Draw two figures that each have a perimeter of 20. They have to be two different shapes. They can't be the same thing. You can't have two squares that look like this, this one up here. You can have one of them that looks like that one, though. Okay, and for the quiz, you're going to uh, measure this one with a ruler and it says we are measuring in inches and this one also you're measuring in inches and it just wants to know the perimeter nothing more than that okay and on the bottom you have some review so this one already has a grid laid out so you can just count the squares to figure out the perimeter you have a time This is subtraction, and this other one is greater than or less than. All right, guys, so we're all set for today.